What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Film study for rookies. Today, man, we're going to be breaking down Colts quarterback Anthony Richardson. And I got to say, I don't think that hate is justified. He played one year last year, didn't even play half the year, out for the season, comes back his second year. It's preseason, right? It is preseason, and he's already being judged. We're going to take a look at some film and see, okay, yes, there are some nicks he can work out. But to say he's a bust, I'll... Come on, man. Let's jump into the film and go from there. So the first play I want to look at right here is a play action, right? Bang, they fake the handoff right there. Finds his guy in the crosser across the middle. Okay. Good throw. There's one thing I think the Colts are going to try and work on when it comes to Anthony Richardson and his drop back right here. Take a look. They're going to run the play action right here. Bang, fake the handoff. Now right here at the top of his drop is where I want you guys to really watch Anthony Richardson right here. Take a look what happens. Top of his drop. He lunges off that back foot. And I think that's where sometimes some of these errant throws kind of come from, all right? Yes, there's going to be pressure back there. Take a look, right? He's got to dodge that a little bit. But this isn't the only time we're going to see him lunge off that back throw. And here's the reason that's a problem, all right? So the reason I think that's a problem when he lunges off that back foot is because he's anticipating the receiver running the 10, 12-yard out route, the 10, 15-yard cross across the middle. He's anticipating them running the same route every single time. That's not going to happen. The defense could be cover six, cover two, cover four, cover three, may box, may double team. There's a lot of different factors that come into play. So when he's lunging off that back foot, right, lunging, he's bringing a lot of momentum. On top of that, he's also a very strong and athletic guy. So he's anticipating the same throw every single time. That receiver isn't going to be there every single time. So what I think the Colts are going to do is, at the top of his drop, set his feet, and then step into the throw whichever way he needs to step. Because if you take a look, if he's bouncing off that back foot, it's going to be hard for him to progress to a second and third read if he's anticipating the crosser and it's not open, right? Let's say a safety drops back and picks it up. Cover two, flat defender drops back, picks it up. Now he's got to go to the next read. I just think top of the drop, right? Bang, bang, bang. Set his feet and then work his way to his throw. Let me know your thoughts. Let's jump to play number two. Next play we're going to look at right here. RPO quick slant. Look at that sidearm. Bang. Again, this dude is athletic. RPO quick read. Watch the DB coming down on that. And what's he do? Throws it around the DB. A sidearm throw around the DB. This is why the Colts like him. All right? we People have to realize that. Not a lot of quarterbacks are doing that. I mean, yeah, some can do it sidearm, but to do it with the power that Anthony Richardson is doing it with, come on, man. Andy has speed. Now, the speed, got to be careful with. You don't want him hurting either one of his shoulders, his legs. Be careful with that. But his athleticism, the sidearm, the quick release, come on, man. This is why the Colts believe in this guy. Let's jump to the next one. The next play right here we're going to look at. Bengals. Middle field open, but pre-snap it wasn't. Pre-snap it looked like a potentially cover one or cover three. And once again, he's showing you he's reading the defense, right? Pre-snap we saw. Middle field closed. As soon as the ball was snapped, bang, the Bengals rotate to a cover two. Also, take a look right here. It's second and short, so he could say, okay, I'm going to try and throw it deep. We still have another down. No, he plays it safe. Goes down to the running back. And remember... This play is very similar to the one we saw before, right? And what I mean by that is on the first play we looked at, we had a go route with a crosser route in the middle and then an out route, right? This time the play's flipped. So we have a go route, bang, crosser, and then you're running back right here, right? Same play, just flipped, right? They run the play action, running back, he's wide open, Bada bing, bada boom. Next play we're going to look at right here. They're going to run a mesh concept. First read the running back. He gets picked up by the edge guy. Then once he do, he goes underneath. Bada bing, bada boom once again. Come on, man. Nobody seems to be talking about this. So let's talk about this play real quick. Receiver right here. Underneath. Bang on the mesh concept. Tight end over the top. Bang. Receiver on the outside. A little spot route in the middle. Running backs on the wheel route right there. And that's going to be his first read. Outside receivers taking his guy in the end zone. Running back is going to be the first read. Take a look right here. Running back's the first read. Edge guy peels off. Bam, he picks him up. So what's his second read? Just like in any mesh concept, the underneath receiver, he's open. Bang. Getting hit right there, 
still hits this guy. So now we see him progressing through the reads. Looks good in the pocket. Let's keep it going. All right, the next play we're going to look at right here, Richardson's going to throw a pick six. Now, is this his fault? I, I go back and forth, honestly. I like Anthony Richardson, but on this play, the more I look at it, the more I'm just not sure. So let me know what you guys think right here. So as we take a look right here, tight end's going to run a stick concept. So in zone, he's going to sit right here. In man, he's going to keep running. Now, I think this is where the confusion in lies, all right? Take a look what happens. Ball snapped. Anthony Richardson's ready to throw it. Tight end, he's open. He's got four or five yards of separation right there. However, he, I think, sees man, so he wants to keep busting that thing to the outside. Anthony Richardson sees five yards of separation. Just sit, and I'll get the ball to you. To me, this is a timing issue. This is one where you have to work it out with your receivers. Even if it looks to be man, I still want you to sit there. To me, it's not that big of a deal because it's a preseason. You're supposed to work these things out. That way, when the season starts, you won't have problems like this. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Let's keep it going. Next play we're going to look at right here. You're going to see he wants to go to the crosser on the inside receiver, and he just overthrows it a little bit too much. And to me, this happens because, once again, look at the drop back, top of his drop, bang. You see him right there. He's like lunging off that back foot, bang. Lunging forward, and it all goes back to the timing. He's anticipating the throw being there just like it was in practice, right? Not anticipating what the receiver is doing. That's what I'm saying about this drop back. He's got to work on that. He's got to slow down. Remember, he's lunging off that back foot and then bringing all that momentum forward. He's going to let that thing rip. He's too strong to be doing that. If he was a little bit of a weaker guy and he needed that momentum, I would get it. But he's too strong. He's got to drop back, set his feet, and then step into the throw. Once he does that, oh, the Colts are cooking. Let's keep it going. Right here is going to be our last play. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Look at this. Pierces the seam in the cover three. One more time so you guys can see right here. Take a look what happens. So take a look what happens right here. Safety starts to cheat up right there. Anthony Richardson's going to see that. And what's he do? He hits the seam. Bang. Woo. Cooking. He is cooking. And look, look what happens right here. Take a look at his drop back right here. Take a look. Sets his feet, steps into the throw. Come on, man. What was that? 25 yards, give or take? If he sets his feet, if he sets his feet, it's, it's over, right? One more time so you guys can see. This is what I'm talking about. Look at that. Gets to the top of his drop right here. Bang. Top of his drop. Steps into the throw. Boom. Because now he's measuring where the throw should be. So with that being said, that's going to wrap it up. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. I do have faith in Anthony Richardson. I just think they have to slow his drop back. I think he's just going too fast. He's too strong to be doing that. You know, in the college game, it's a little bit different. In the NFL, your receivers aren't going to be able to run their five, seven-yard outs the same way every time. The crossers, the same way every time. They're going to pick up on that. They're going to watch film. So with that being said, that's going to wrap it up. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Stay tuned. More content coming soon.